So today I want to show you how to use our mockups to create your own digital images of your products. And we're going to do three programs. And first we are starting with Inkscape. So the first thing you're going to do is drag and drop the mockup photo that you'd like to use. Um, here I'm using our light pink keychain um, mockup blank. So you'll see we just dragged and dropped that into Inkspace. And now you're just going to go to the SVG that you want to use and you're going to drag and drop that into ink space. That box is going to come up and you're just going to hit OK. And it just shows you what the DPI and everything is. So you hit OK. And now you can go ahead and resize that design so that it fits within the keychain blank. And you can go ahead and take a look and make sure it's centered and that everything looks the way you want it to. And now you're just gonna go up to File and Export PNG Image and Export As, and here you're going to where choose where you want the file to go to. You're going to name the file. In this case, I'm gonna name it the Cactus Keychain Mockup and hit Save. Now, before we export it, you wanna select all the pieces here. So I just click the background image and then hold down shift, click the SVG, make sure it's all highlighted and now export. And you'll see here that now our image is exported on our desktop and you can open it up. And there you go. We've just created a mock-up image using Inkscape. For our second tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create a mock-up image, and this time we're going to be using Silhouette Studio, and this is the business edition. So similar, we're opening up a new blank document, and we're just going to drag and drop the blank mock-up image that we would like to use, and now I'm just zooming out so that we can see the whole thing. And now we're going to drag and drop the SVG that we want to use, and just like with Inkscape, you're just going to resize that SVG until you're happy with the sizing and how everything looks. Once we're happy, we're just going to select all and go up to file, save selection, save to hard drive. And again, choose the location. You're going to name it again, cactus keychain backup, or excuse me, mockup in this case, and then change the file type. And we're, I'm gonna do a PNG file and then you're just going to hit OK and now this box will come up so you can see the size of the image and the DPI hit save and as you can see on my desktop I have the image here and we're going to open it up and there you go there is your final mock-up image using Silhouette Studio Business Edition so for the final tutorial I'm going to show you how to create a mock-up with a design that you've created in Cricut Design Space. Since we can't export a design, we have to do this differently. First, we're going to go up here and go into Settings and select No Grid and hit OK. So that way we have a blank background. And now you're going to take a screenshot of your screen and you're going to save the image onto your desktop. Now we need to go into our browser and we're going to remove .bg, and you're just going to upload the screenshot we just took. And what this is gonna do is it's going to remove the background. Hit download, and again, I'm just gonna drag that download onto my desktop for easier access. And I'm going to, in this case, use design, or excuse me, Inkscape. And just like before, dragging and dropping that image into Inkscape, and exact same thing as our first tutorial, I'm going to resize and reposition that image until I'm happy with the way it looks. And now we're basically just going back to that first tutorial. Once we like how everything is, we're going up and we're going to file and export it as PNG. The whole reason we had to do it this way is because two reasons. First, if I was to create a mock-up image in design space, I would not be able to export that image because Design Space does not have that capability. Also, in our case, the images that I sell through Design Bundles are too high of a resolution for Cricut. And so if you upload them into Cricut and try to pull them up into your blank canvas, they 
Cricut Design Space does something and it distorts the image. So you can still create a mock-up for any designs you've created in Cricut. You just have to go about this roundabout way. I hope this guys this helps. If you have any questions, go ahead and let me know below. And just so you can see here, this is the final image. I hope you guys have a great day.